Hey there YouTube, love to boat 92 here. So today I am uh, saving some more old gas cans. Every time I go to an auction I always try to buy one or two of them. And these ones here are, there's one's a kerosene can, a kerosene five gallon, and then this one's a, a five gallon for gas, and then those two are, I don't know, two and a half or two and a quarter gallons. Uh, this one here is in the worst shape. There's quite a few dents and stuff on it. Uh, you can see on the side. And then this piece, this was pushed in here. Uh, yeah, there's there's some, definitely some dents in them, but I think I only paid a buck or two for that thing. <clears throat> and then this one here is actually in probably the best shape, at least the steel is. Uh, this uh, nozzle here is ripped. I'm going to have to figure out something to do with that. I I don't know. Uh, it's tough to find these caps. I may just have to buy a parts gas can and see what I can do for that. But this is a true test. I think this one might be an eagle. I'm not... Uh, I'm not real sure. I can't really read it. And this one here I actually got for free. This one was given to me. Uh, this is an eagle. But they all need... They all need repainted and whatnot, but I took a a brush. This was, I think, a free brush. I got like four or six of them in a pack from Harbor Freight. And I'm using Simple Green and LA's Totally Awesome to clean it. Uh, generally, actually, this cap sort of needs done again, but in a in the groove here is where all the dirt collects and right around the edge under the cap is where it all collects. But it, all the lids and stuff screw off. I don't know what brand this one is. This one's, you can't really read it. I don't know. I don't know, hard to tell. <clears throat> so I figured I'd show you guys what they all look like before. Uh, this one actually has kind of a, a neat screw design thing. I've never seen one of these before, but I guess you can regulate how much gas comes out. And they all have vents in them. This one I've never seen before. They have a push button. So I guess you hold and push for the vent, which is kind of neat. I may take that off because it's a little loose and whatnot. Uh, this one here, you know, I, I, I love these old gaskins. I can just unscrew this one here to put the gas from the uh, nozzle in at the gas station. And obviously this one's what we pour out of here. So even the back one kind of serves a dual purpose, uh, filling it up at the gas station and also working as a vent. And they all have a vent in them and a cap, except for this one, a cap in the back. So I wanted to, sh wanted to show you guys what they look like before and figured uh, you guys might like to see this. So the, hopefully the next clip I'll I'll have everything painted up and you guys will see what it looks like. I would take a video of it, but it's kind of boring and it's just a bunch of me painting. It's, it's just not that interesting. So I've just about finished the gas cans, or restoring them, repainting them, whatever you want to call it. And they actually look pretty good. They turned out relatively... I mean, as good as I can get them, I don't have a spray booth or anything. So this is one can. This was the blue one, and it's all red now. It actually looks better in person than it does on camera. But you can see they're pretty red. Uh, I should not have painted over the, the little yellow thing, the vent. Uh, I have other ones I can put in, so that's really no big deal. This one was the red one with the handle. Uh, I have the two caps over on the sawhorse here that are getting painted black. This one I still have to put the vent in, in the cap here. And then I've, I thought about painting this, but I don't know, I may or may not. This, is, this top piece here is just glued onto the cap and then uh, this last can is, they're all painted, and they all look pretty good. 
The spout on this one was ripped really bad. I plastic welded it back together. I may just take that off and find another cap and just patch it. Uh, this one wasn't as bad, but it was still ripped. And I don't really... These spouts are nice, don't get me wrong. I, I, I like to keep them if I could. But it's tough finding the right threading for these old cans. So... I enjoy saving these old gas cans, and the heck, I'll probably get... The, as long as I take care of these things, these things will probably last me the rest of my life, so... I brush these with... This is some... Um, Gloss Sunset Red. I did two coats of the red, and two should be enough. And then I'm spraying the two caps for that one. This Rust-Oleum Painter's Touch Paint and Primer Gloss Black. I could have just painted those red, but it's nice having a little contrast, and I maybe should have done that too, but yeah, they're red, and it's good enough. They're painted. I'm happy. I may not keep any of those spouts, so we'll see. And the... Here's the two caps. And they look pretty good. I'll probably do three or four, I don't know, two or three, four uh, coats of this. Because this is spray paint and it's not going to be as strong. So, I think that's about all I have to say for this video. Thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more. I'll see you all in the next video.